Right, so a lot of young setters, they are not being taught to be an offensive threat. It is really crucial to be constantly up and holding the blocker with you. They should not know when are you going to strike. As a matter of fact, you should know, your team should know, and the opposing team should know. What that means, you gotta go in with mentality to set, and the last, last second is when you are changing your mind, dropping your right arm, and pushing ball down with your left arm. Your body gotta remain neutral, okay? So you can go in different hands. You gotta go up to set and exchange the arms. So when you practice, you should look like this. Up, push down. All right, young setters, in America we see it a lot, 6-2 systems, even 5-1 if you're a back row, you can still attack. The main thing is staying below the level of the tape, so no jumping as you're attacking in front of the 10-foot line. Uh, you've got to remain deceptive, so always go in with a mindset, I'm going to set body neutral and then strike to the side. One of the ways to practice, here we go, self toss, running in, push to the side. Don't look over, don't acknowledge anything, just quick attack and you should be great. All right, setters, another way to attack is behind the blocker. This is especially effective if the blockers are tied together towards the middle. You're coming in and you see the spot open. You've got your back row player way back there, the blocker stepped up, daydreaming over here. You can always attack, especially if the ball is coming kind of have momentum towards the back. So if it's being passed on this side of the court, it doesn't have to be too tight. You're coming up the set and pushing it straight down behind. 